Tonight on Instant Replay Live, we're going to take a turn for the serious. This is going to be a public service announcement. For all you heroin users out there, <laughs> Nick, take it away from here. Just next time you're buying heroin, please avoid the cheap stuff, uh, because it could be Crocodile in disguise. <laughs> Somehow, Joe has never heard of it, actually, which surprises me living on the internet, as we do. Um, there's a, a drug, very popular in Russia, and has made its way to America now in a few places, oh, called Crocodile. Um, I think it's like K-R-O-K-I-D-I-L. It might have some C's in there, I don't remember. But um, <clears throat> if you look it up, be ready for some disgusting NSFW pictures. It's kind of like injecting yourself with brown recluse venom. <laughs> Did you look it up? No. Oh, okay, I mean, just from our description, descriptions? Yeah. Yes, that's accurate, yes. Um, I, I was just wondering, because that was so, that was such an accurate, like, statement, I, mean, I wondered if you were. I don't know, were you, were you, were you accurate when you said it was, um, oh, yes. Drano and, like, bleach and stuff like that in there? Uh, well, it's, so it's, like, it's a synthetic heroin with, like, like, like yeah, it, it can sometimes be, um, uh, I guess, like, filled out with that kind of stuff. Like, that's how... I mean, if it has Drano in it, it is it. going to melt your flesh. Yeah, and it does. Like, it... Um, the pictures are literally people's, like, exposed bones and, like, dead, lifeless skin of... The, like, like it might be, like, their leg, but their whole calf is just Shit. bone, and then down to the foot <laughs> is flesh, and it's all, yeah, like... That's gray and sickly and just, just need to give them some bath salts so they can start trying to eat people yeah and then it would be full on zombie apocalypse um yeah it's so crazy uh that that anyone could see that effect and then be like yeah but the heroin's really cheap so it's it's, it's worth the risk yeah. <laughs> yeah like first of all how is heroin not bad enough <laughs> like the addiction and effects of addiction of heroin, uh, like, uh, that, too far already. And then to add something that literally peels your flesh away and just leaves you with exposed dead bone that doctors have to saw off. I, I can't. I, I Joe, I literally can't. You can't even? You just white girled so hard I, right now. I, I can't even. <laughs> it's the worst. So, yeah, if you go looking up Crocodile, I won't show any here. Uh, just be beware of what you're looking for, what you're headed into. The most disgusting thing. And, I mean, it literally does look like they are from The Walking Dead, like, prop department. Yeah. Yeah, really weird stuff. I'll have to look it up after I get off of this. I really... Oh, god damn it! Like, oh. I, it's one of those things where I can't recommend looking it up. Eh, morbid curiosity is getting the better of me. This yeah, point. right. About it too like, much. you kind of have to see it. Mm. Like, don't don't look it up, but you kind of have to see it. <laughs> I mean, what, so what's the worst thing you've looked up on the internet or you've watched on the internet? Like, or just like oh, I don't know that I should watch this, but now that I, it's in front of me, like I'm gonna watch it. Um, I mean, any kind of stuff where it claims that a real person is dying. Oh, uh, so, so that actually the, the worst thing I've seen was the, the decapitation video. Um, from, uh, that was sent, you know, to oh, the media, the, one like, of the reporters. Yeah, terrorist decapitation. Uh, yeah. yeah. It was just like, oh my goodness. Because the, the separation of, like, empathy that happens, like... So I, I didn't see that one. So mm. I, I don't know, I guess, all the details. I mean, I know the details from the news, but I don't know the actual, like, imagery that goes with that. But um, I've seen other things close enough to it that it's just like... I, I've never enjoyed any kind of human pain videos. Well, right. that's not true. Funny levels of pain where it's like, ah, he'll be fine. You know, those are okay. But I've never enjoyed any serious pain or or violence or death especially. Like, like Faces of Death, those old like VHS tapes where they'll show like a person falling out of a building or whatever. Oh, man. Um, yeah. That stuff just doesn't appeal to me in, in any way. Oh, yeah. Except in fiction. Now, if it's, like, a zombie movie and someone literally gets their face peeled off down to the skeleton, like, down to the skull, then that would be super awesome. <laughs> like, mm. I am all good with evil dead, you know, gore fountains of blood. Um, everything there is cool, and and anything real is just, like, why would you propagate? Except, I, I guess the only reason you would want to propagate it 
not that I think this really even works, but is to be like, look how horrible it is. Maybe we should stop hurting each other. You know? Right. Hey, humanity. No, I'm dumb. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Why? Uh, oh, you just lost a thing. I can't take... Uh, I got it back, but... I can't take... Um, crotch hits like i love watching like fail videos and stuff but um yeah crotch hits just like you got like oh man that's a story there well kind of which one you got like nailed in the nuts one time oh in school when (laughs) yeah didn't you like bleed for a few days like it was pretty bad i don't i i I bled for a day uh okay but uh i so what happened was uh there was a girl she got bullied in school a lot and uh some kids had gone through her book bag and like taken stuff out and thrown it on the ground and, uh, you have a lot of weird book bag stories. Uh, I mean, I don't know what it is, man. <laughs> uh, but uh, so kids threw it, and I was standing near her book bag um, when she uh, when she found it, when she came back to it, uh-huh. and she just was like, it's, Assumed it's it him, was it's, he did it. Yeah. And I was like talking to somebody else, leaning, leaning away, and she had boots on, and she came up and lifted her leg up, knee like perpendicular to her torso, and just jammed her foot uh, into my into my balsticles, and uh, it oh my gosh, it was yeah. like uh, it's it's still one of the worst things. Like my yeah. stomach was like you'll, tightened to to the max. And, you'll never uh, have children. Yeah, it's, a, it's I was. Uh, I mean, it's a genuine concern genuine actually concern. at the time. I, yeah, I've at not least. taken any tests. But, yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't know. Uh, it it was. That's not. That's really. Oh, gosh. <laughs> that's really all there is to it. Yeah. Um, but uh. No. Yeah. No. I remember that. But it is weird. Like, so that has to do with the book bag. The fish tank thing had to do with the, a book. Both a, were in the same classroom. And then, and then the wasp story where you get sent to the attic was because you tossed your book bag down. Well, my books. I didn't have a book bag. Oh, okay. Well, I had still, a binder that I threw. Still, like, what is it with you and school books getting you in trouble? Clearly, the, le- the the lesson is that stay out of school, kids. Yeah, please don't go and educate <laughs> yourselves. America has too much of it. Yeah. Um, oh, good, you didn't die there. Look, I'm going to. <laughs> don't 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 you think you know me? <laughs> Shit. Um. No. Oh wow, that was like just like the worst way to die too, like. You were already going to die by falling, but then he had to stab you one time mm. on your way down. Hey, hey, <laughs> you don't die until I say you die. Yeah. Now you can die. Oh, shit. I don't like these guys. Only when I have poked you with my trident, then you may have permission to die. <laughs> Joe doesn't ever laugh. I don't, I don't mm-hmm. have emotions. Yeah. That's because you got kicked in the balls. The, and it, the, the emotions went out. It the made you went out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just, God. And the virus is now much more uh, relatable. Relatable, to, relatable yeah. to me. Now you know how it happened. Uh, <laughs> That's how it happened. Yeah. He got, okay. He, he was going through. I mean, he was he was standing near a book bag. Someone had, had rifled through. I think the worst thing that happened to me, and I think in the same classroom, actually, the same science room for that grade. Um was that I, we had to stand up in line and like get something from the teacher's desk and like microscopes or something for, from him. Mm. And um, the worst thing I can imagine, or I can remember happening, there was a girl I liked and a guy knew that. So we were standing there behind her and I was just kind of standing there, you know, in a relaxed stance, waiting for my turn to move up. And he did the like, perfect grab of my wrist and swing it forward that my wrist kind of whipped Mm -hmm. and made me slap her on the ass oh what a dick and uh yeah i mean all around it's a it's a bad thing but she turned around so pissed off because she was convinced i had done it like Mm -hmm. and and it didn't make sense because like even though i did like her we had hung out so many times and she knew how shy i was there was no way in any world, that would be the kind of guy I would be. Sure, but I mean, what else? Like, it's just the, what's what's the the not obvious like. But she I explained was immediately uh-huh. what happened, and uh, and she just she was so mad she wasn't buying it, and uh, I mean, Nick. ultimately she just like touched my neck. Jesus, it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. Uh, ultimately, she was fine with it, and we just moved on. 
Mm. But just like in the moment, she had like that pure like white hot rage when she looked back at me, and I was like, it wasn't me. I didn't do it. And uh, and she just wouldn't believe me. It was weird. But she didn't kick me in the balls. Dude, I don't know what to do here. Cause this thing's gonna hurt me. Uh, this is gonna hurt me so bad. Can you spear it? No, cause it's too low. Oh, uh, yeah. Wait, can I can you... jump over it. Uh, oh, interesting. Nice. Oh. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. No. I like that, I was like, nice! <laughs> yes. Yeah. Did it. Oh, there was another cool thing in that room, actually. Um, Science room? Yeah, yeah. They had the like little outlets on the desks for all the, you know, yeah. whatever you'd have to plug in, Bunsen burners or whatever. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That was probably a little gas or something. But, um, and uh, there was a kid, and he was like, hey, hey, how, how badly do you dare me to stick a key in the socket? Oh my god. And, uh, like, it was like, dude, you're an idiot. Don't, don't do that, was the response that we gave him. Mm hmm and he was like, come on, you don't dare me? You don't dare me? And I was like, no, don't do it, you t you, you moron. And uh, and he, so he was like, it's fine. And then he stuck a key in. And like we all like kind of jumped back a little bit, like, oh, God, mm -hmm. what's going to happen? And nothing happened. And we're like, oh, all right. <laughs> like, and he's like, do you dare me to stick another one in? And then at that point, we're kind of curious. Oh, no. <laughs> so, so it was like, uh, all right, let's see. <laughs> and he stuck another key in. And it was the craziest fucking thing. First of all, the, just like the noise, you know, of that electrical pop of mm -hmm. an explosion went off. But I swear to God, before that happened, in slow motion, I watched as a like, uh, like, like, Street Fighter level ball of energy like appeared between his two keys and it kind of like it formed there and then arced out and fired at his shoulder. He got totally shocked by it because he was holding on to both keys connecting the current, mm -hmm. uh, completing the circuit. And <laughs> then the pop happened, smoke is rising up, the teacher is yelling, he goes to retrieve his keys. As he's getting yelled at. And it comes off completely from the socket. It has completely melted one of the two keys nice. in the socket. <laughs> and he goes, That's my only house key. My mom doesn't get off until 8. <laughs> oh, man. And the teacher yanked him out of there. Like, it was clear that he was not going to be making it to the end of the day before he'd have to go home anyway. That Someone was coming to pick him up. But it was. I felt a little bad because I was like, well, I kind of dared him to do it, but only after he had like pushed mm -hmm. it too far. Well, all right, we'll we'll do more Volgar uh, next time on Instant Replay Live. Sounds good. Swish, 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 dancing Volgar. <laughs> Wow, wow. You really kick it. Kick Yo, it. plans, free stroke, Sonic Golf. Sonic Golf.